whenever you buy a used car, always pay attention to the gaps in the door. This is how you could tell if it's been in an accident or not. What isn't allowed here? Racism. And what did we learn? There are people now. Yup. <laughs> what up, y'all? We back again. This is Top Things. The worst way to go out on the battlefield is getting a headshot from a camper waiting for his moment. Here, try this it's delicious. When'd you start gardening? Your Honor, the cause of death was attempting to drink from a glass of water. Just kidding, he survived. She's fed up with my ape impression. Taking my gremlin for a walk. Oh, oh hell yeah, this place has beef, bro. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, hell yeah, this place has beer. Taking your dog for a walk across these river stones can be quite a challenge. Scooby Dooby Doo, where are you? We have some work to do now. The true meaning of dedication is risking your life from a potential execution to get content for your YouTube channel. So this is it. So when you are bowing, please keep your hands at your sides. To be honest, it was quite strict that you can't sit down. I couldn't film a lot of it, even though I got a bit. And if you take a picture of the statue, you have to get the whole thing in shot. You can't like crop in or like zoom into his head or something. Excuse me, sir. I'm super lost. Can you give me directions? Uh, sure. I'm listening to children screaming. Have a great day. costume's getting a lot of attention. So apparently no one dresses up for Halloween here. I wish I'd known that before I used grease paint for my mustache. And I can't even take off my hat because then I'm Hitler. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world's most entertaining supermarket. Next time when you complain about your job. Madame, ça va? What do you want to order? I'm vegan. Okay. I have some asparagus. Uh, can I please have? I'm gonna get. Uh, can I just get six nuggets, please? Six nuggets, anything else? Uh, let me just check with my friend. Hold up. You want anything else? I'm good. No, I think that's it. Thank you. Uh, uh, what sauces you got with that one? Sir? What sauces y'all got? Six nuggets. Yeah, like what sauces? Sauces, like for sauces. Sauce? For, yeah. I only barbecue, sweet chili, sweet sauce, super sauce, <laughs> with tomato. God damn, that's a lot. <laughs>
Can, you, like, can you slow that down? Because I, I didn't hear a goddamn thing. Sorry. What? No, is what? Hello? <laughs> what the duck is going on here? Some people are getting way too comfortable on this app. As you can see, I have some pet ducks and I'm going to see if I can communicate with them. Okay, ready? <laughs> Let me try again. Oh. I don't think- I think I insulted them, honestly. No. 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 Bottom line is we need to get a dog for protection. Like if someone tried to break into our house, I'd want to make sure that they were immediately terrified. When it comes to sarcasm, British comedy is on a proper level. Why have you got an automatic? A bus my arm. That's why it took a long time to get out. You really Which broken your arm? Which arm yes. have you broken? <laughs> It's the 21st century, but this man has the amazing ability to speak the language of 50,000 BC. When your wedding day is an unforgettable event, but not because of the bride and groom. In the middle of an important interview, nature calls and you know what that means. If you gotta go, you gotta go. My next question to you is five years from now, what are some personal goals of yours? Nothing to do with business. What do you personally want to do? Bruv, I'm so sorry. Um, I just need to take a shit. Do you mind just waiting for a second? I'll be back in a second. I just need to take a shit, yeah? Right. Cheers. Thanks. I knew this was an interview. Despite the big size difference, these fish aren't gonna back down to a fight with the house cat. Thank you so much. Oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're so sweet. <laughs> 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 
I'm in the ghetto. I'm in the ghetto. People ask me what I'm And then I have drama. You can tell by his excitement that he's been waiting to do this all day. How I radio check the team. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. I would like a quick radio check. Could you reply with a... My dog stepped on a bee. I'm driving an LTM 1750. When your cat asks you to record something for it and then asks you after if you caught it. I'm having a wonderful time at this party. Oh, hello, who are you? Oh, my God. I didn't consent to watching that. Ooh. Better, better. Yeah. Why are you coming to piss right next to me? Because I want a good view. No, it's not about the view. Can you not see how much spaces there are? Can you do like my man over there, bro? He's like seven spaces away. Why you gotta do it right I next to the man? Be, I be bro, right you're here. moving like you wanna see wood though. You, do you swing that way? Mm, no, 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 do you? Do you? Do you, do you swing that way? Do you like do you like it? Uh, uh, no, uh, so, so come over here and stand there, bro. There's space over here. You got man walking around the toilet with my trousers down and that, bro. Oh, Guys are all looking at me. Look, look at the use, bro. This is what I mean, bro. You're, you're violating, oh, my bro. Bad. I didn't know, stand bro. over there and take a piss, bro. My name is bugging a lot, a lot. When you finally encounter an enchanted unicorn, but it seems to be malfunctioning. Hey, hello. I'm a kid. <laughs> Marriage lesson number 36. Randomly check the freezer and get a good lawyer while you're at it. See those two frozen beers? Those two beers were in this freezer. And guess what happened? Because those two beers were left in the freezer and frozen made a little bit of a mess, I'm no longer allowed to use the freezer. At 51 years old, my wife says, you're no longer allowed to use the freezer in the house. The ironic thing is, is I didn't put the beers in the freezer. My wife did. And I'm getting in trouble because they were left in the freezer. I didn't even know she put them in the freezer. But because I was the one who bought the beers originally from the beer store, it's my fault. And I'm no longer allowed to use the freezer. Hey, life ain't fair. And do I even argue about it? No, no point. Cause I'm gonna lose. He enlisted in the army, but on this day he became a marine.
Most people hate the rainy weather, but these guys find a way to make fun out of it instead. Get a coffee. <laughs> Do you think the family's reaction to this face reveal is just plain wrong or completely justifiable? Like what you see? You're gonna love what we have next. Before you go, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys again on the next one.